In this video, I'm going to share with you how to create a reverse VLOOKUP in Excel. If you want to learn how to do this, just stick around and watch until the very end of this video. VLOOKUP is considered one of the most popular lookup functions in Excel. But despite of its popularity, it has several limitations and with this, you cannot use VLOOKUP in every table structure. One of its great disadvantages is that you need to position your lookup array in the very first column or in the leftmost column of your table. In this example, we're going to search for a Canadian province or territory based on the selected capital on our drop-down list. Looking at the reference table on this side, the position of our lookup array, which is our capital, is located in our second column, while the provinces and territories in the first column. Therefore, regular VLOOKUP is not appropriate in this scenario. Before we start in writing our VLOOKUP formula, allow me to explain how we could create a simple table using choose function. Let's type equals choose, then open curly bracket, enter our index number as 1 and 2, and close it with another curly bracket. By the way, 1 and 2 represents the order of our columns for our two columns. Then let's enter our first range as A2 to A15, followed by our second range B2 to B15. So our complete formula would be equals choose 1, 2, range A to A5 or A15, B2 to B15. As you may have seen, we are able to create a new table based on this formula. We just simply need to change the position of our columns as 2 and 1 so that it, it will be useful for our VLOOKUP. See the difference? Then let's copy this formula. Now let's start creating our VLOOKUP formula. Let's type equal VLOOKUP, then select cell E2 as our lookup value. For our table array, let's paste our formula that we have previously created. Then enter 2 as our column index number. And finally, we need to select exact match to complete our formula. Here's the complete VLOOKUP formula that we created. If you like this video, please consider subscribing and share this video with your friends. See you next time guys!